Cap 7 Action News starts right now with a breaking news alert. We begin with breaking news out of Detroit. After 47 days on the picket line, Detroit's last striking casino workers now headed back to work. Thank you for joining us at 10. I'm Simon Shaykett. The Detroit Casino Council says union members have voted overwhelmingly to ratify a new contract with MGM Grand Detroit. 7 Action News reporter Tierra Braddock breaks down this deal. MGM Grand Casino workers are finally packing up their belongings from out on the picket line. They have voted overwhelmingly yes to a contract between them and the casino. Uh, strikes over. Oh, it is? Union members with the Detroit Casino Council struck a deal with MGM Grand Detroit on Thursday and voted to ratify it on Saturday. We're finally at the finish line, and I, like I tell everybody, this is what happens when you fight. We win. Alicia Weaver has been a guest room attendant at MGM Grand for 24 years. Weaver says she was overwhelmed with emotions after learning her fellow union workers voted yes to ratify the latest tentative agreement from the casino. The main thing she was fighting for was fair wages. My son works at MGM and he'll be celebrating 13 years at the casino. And my fight was really more personal because I wanted to make sure that I have something where he can build on, something more stable, but most importantly, making sure that the company recognized his worth. According to the DCC, the five-year agreement that covers 1,700 employees includes the largest wage increases for MGM Grand Detroit workers. Once the contract is ratified, workers will receive an immediate 18% pay raise on average and an immediate $3 per hour raise. Also, a bonus, workload reductions, and no health care cost increases. You know, we deserve it. Gabrielle Hernandez was part of the negotiation committee for the MGM Grand Union workers. Yeah, I was somebody that never really cared about health care until I had my son two years ago. And that was something that, that changed me as a man myself. So to be on this, the committee and fight for that health care was just an amazing experience to be able to do. The president of the MGM Grand Resorts Midwest Group sent a statement regarding the tentative agreement that reads, we're glad our DCC represented employees voted tonight to ratify the 64 month contract and end the strike, allowing us to immediately resume full and normal operations at MGM Graham Detroit. MGM Graham workers were the last of the union members from the three casinos to end their strike. Now they can leave the picket line for good and get back to work. Congratulations! Yes. You did it! You did yes. it! The Detroit Casino Council has to meet with MGM Grand to determine when exactly the workers can get back into work. In downtown Detroit, Tierra Braddock, 7 Action News.